grad that I started um, end of December 2009. I was approached by one of the best suppliers and shoemakers here in Marikina with his skills and my design ano, um, skills. We <laughs> um, came out to the first collection for Sita We decided on the concept of the 50s because well, I have a slight obsession with anything 50s. I love Audrey Hepburn. I love red lipstick. And I love full skirts. So Paira, we just wanted to do something fun, but still very editorial, very high fashion. We also uh, had like the best location for the concept right here in Marikina. It's Mama Chick's Coffee House. And it has the complete like a piece liner concept now. Why don't you sit right down and Why not Rima? <laughs> She's like perfect for the whole 50s concept. Her look is very sweet but still fierce enough. And then she's also very kissy and super payat. Niya. So, it's perfect na perfect for the whole Audrey Hepburn the peg. Sobrang medyo kamukha niya si Audrey Hepburn red. Yeah, I love her eyes. It's, um, it's what we call the smiling eyes. She can actually smile without her teeth. <laughs> she can do that, smile with her eyes. Not her nose, not her nose. But with your nose? Ayan, yeah, yeah. One, two, three, go. Winner! <laughs> when Ira told me it was 50s inspired, I was really, really excited because this is my first time to actually do a 50s inspired shoot. Na talagang full force na ganito. The whole Audrey Hepburn look. And um, she's really one of my idols. And portraying her and exemplifying her in the way I look, my makeup, my clothes, um, talagang it, it felt like such an honor. It felt like such a privilege to be able to do that. The highlight! I like it when uh, we made Rima lie down on the floor, the very, very dirty floor, and then she came out with high staff. <laughs> I've gotten some belts from her. She's really the nicest, the kindest, the most accommodating. But more than anything today, I saw the oziness. As an oziness to the next level. Her shoes are all nicely placed in boxes. You know how you have to put masking tape underneath just so it doesn't get dirty. Her clothes are all nicely hangered in a rack. All her layouts are really well planned. Her pegs were beforehand prepared. As in lahat talagang to the last detail, everything was really well planned. Working with Ira was very easy. She knew what she wanted, so it wasn't that hard to go about the entire thing because she had the vision and hopefully we were able to pull it off. efficient photographers you could ever ever work with. Number one, super deli ng makausap. And she's like steady. She's like always game na lang for any concept. And sobrang she doesn't hesitate in telling what she thinks. And another thing is sobrang bilis na magtrabaho. Like you just tell her what you want and she easily gets it. I don't even have to hire um, an art director because she's na yung gumagawa ng lahat. was very fun. The location was very inspiring and Rima was very inspiring as well and she took direction very well. The makeup was awesome and the styling also. And of course the shoes. I was actually taken by surprise when I found out about the Sinta collection. Because um, I know Ira does belts and she does really fabulous belts. But today when I really saw the shoes and actually wore them, Wow lang talaga masasabi ko because um, they're very fashion forward and at the same time, comfort talaga. It's like style, but you're not compromising comfort. 
Sana, ano pa ba? Clothes na yung next. <laughs> may belts na, may shoes, clothes na. The Sinta collection is actually very feminine, but there's like a kick. There's a thump, talaga. It's for Filipinos with power. Parang ganun. Bigla kong pinahistawisan. Ah! 